This is a video for a friend of mine in Queensland. I wanted to show him how you can turn uh, leftovers into meals. Uh, I just went down town and saw these. These are only two seventy five. They're pork chipolottos. Fancy name for sausages, but so I'm going to cook those up. This is the curry that we've had in the fridge for a couple of days. Still good. And I thought what I'd do is I'd cut up some uh, potatoes. And if you look at some of these, they've got little hairy bits on the end. People would generally throw that, but they're fine. They're still firm. Just cut off the skin. Even if there's a tinge of little grain, just cut that off. So there's a whole heap of potatoes that need to be processed anyway. The curry. And I'm going to cook the sausages up. And then I'm going to put them in these containers. Which I'm sure you've all seen. But what this means is that I'm making use of what I've got, filling these up, put them in the freezer, put a date on them. So that's going to give us probably, I'm going to guess, I'm thinking four to five meals. Uh, and these potatoes are actually only, I think, 50 cents for all those. And I'd already made the curry up. So we're going to have a sort of curry with sausages, mashed potato in a container. And whenever you come home, uh, my friend in Queensland, you can just put one out of the freezer. You put it on about 160 in the oven, about 40 minutes later, you've got a dinner. So let's get this on the road. All right, uh, we've made the mashed potato. I didn't want to bother you with showing you how to mash it. I've also cooked up all these little sausages that are going to go in there. And of course, this is the curry. It is superb. There's probably going to be a bit left over here to have another meal. But what we're going to do is we're just going to stick about... Oh, Roughly three, and let's have a look. See how many we got. Some might get three, some might get four. So these sausages were about two fifty, two sixty, I think. And potatoes are cheap, and the curry I'd already made. So this is only going to be about a dollar per meal. So what I'm going to do now. You can see the mashed sausages. All I'm going to do is get some of the curry, which has got all sorts of vegetables in it as well. I'm just going to pour it over the top. And these are going to be superb. They're just going to be frozen. And when we want a quick meal, we'll put labels on them as you'll see, see shortly. Make sure you know there's just going to be just the right amount for all of this. Looked out really good. So there we go, I have made five meals from leftovers, right, now some people might think, oh that's not a big enough meal, it is, it's well and truly big enough for even you in Queensland, you know who I'm talking about. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to put the lids on them, and we will actually then, and I'll show you these two, so you've got the lids that go on here, when you put the lids on, some people make the mistake of putting the, like the blank side up. That's what you want to do, because this is going to get the heat from the oven. So it simply goes on there. Let me just do this one. And all we do is pull down that side, that side, there, and then just crimp the corners. Okay, very easy. Now, before the magic of uh, television came on, we couldn't do this, but I'm just going to go... Alright, so what we've done is we've got a printer, so we've just printed out a label. You can just write on it with an ink pen if you like. So all I'm going to do, so we've got uh, what it is, it's curry, curried sausages and mash, um, which is, uh, like I say, a mixed match of leftover foods turned into meals. So for about, now these containers, uh, you buy them in six, I think they're about 240, something like that. So they're about 40 cents for a container. The ingredients, I don't know, were probably... 80 90 cents so for about a dollar or maybe just over a dollar a meal you can have um you don't have to have these every night they go in the freezer you've got a date on them they're good for two three months so when you want a hot meal you just pick up one of these my queensland friend this will be frozen by the way oven 160 degrees celsius on put it in the oven leave for 40 45 minutes take it out with a towel because you'll get burned and then you have a meal it's as simple as that so this can be anything left over 
So roast, put in some roast potatoes and peas and corn. There are, there are many people that just keep throwing what they call leftover food out, turn it into something else. My mum and my grandmother used to always say, mend and make do. So next time, if you have been, thanks for watching.